Hello everyone. I am Balaji Rao. Welcome to BR Max class. If you like this video, share it with your friends and subscribe to my YouTube channel to get more updates. Learn how to list all the relations from set A to set B. Consider two sets A equal to set 1 comma 2 and B equals to set 3 comma 4. We need to calculate A cross B. A cross B equals to set 1 comma 2 cross set 3 comma 4. How to write A cross B? You take first element in first set and pair with all the elements of second set. That is, you take an element 1 in set A and pair with all the elements of set B. That is, ordered pair 1 comma 3 comma ordered pair 1 comma 4. Now, you take second element in first set and pair with all the elements of second set. That is, you take an element 2 in set A and pair with all the elements of set B. That is, ordered pair 2 comma 3 comma ordered pair 2 comma 4. Now, we calculated A cross B when they given A and B. I quickly revise what is the definition of relation. Any subset of A cross B is called relation from A to B. We already discussed about what is relation in class 2. If you want to know more clearly about relation, you please watch class 2. From class 2, we learned that total number of relations from set A to set B equals to 2 power number of elements in A cross B. 2 power number of elements in A cross B. You observe the set A cross B. How many elements are there in set A cross B? 4 elements are there. So, total number of relations from set A to set B equal to 2 power 4. 2 power 4 equals to 16. So, when set A is having 2 elements, set B is having 2 elements, then number of relations from set A to B equal to 2 power 4, that equals to 16. To list all the relations from A to B, you need to write all the subsets of A cross B. Let's start listing all the relations. I'll take first relation as R1. R1 equal to empty set. Is empty set is a subset of A cross B? Empty set is subset of every set. So obviously, empty set is subset of A cross B. So R1 is a subset of A cross B. So R1 is relation from A to B. Now, write the second relation R2. R2, I'll take all the elements of A cross B. R2 equals to ordered pair 1 comma 3, ordered pair 1 comma 4, ordered pair 2 comma 3, ordered pair 2 comma 4. You observe, I take in all the elements of A cross B. That is, the set R2 contains all the elements of A cross B. Is R2 is a subset of A cross B? Yes. We know that every set is subset to itself. So, R2 is a relation from A to B. Now, I'll write all single element subsets to A cross B. R3, R3, I take only one element from A cross B. R3 is a set which contains only one element that is ordered pair 1 comma 3. You observe R3 is subset of A cross B. All the elements present in R3 are present in A cross B. Yes, then R3 is called relation from A to B. Similarly, I'll write R4. R4, I consider a set which contains only one element that is ordered pair 1 comma 4. R contains only one element that is ordered pair 1 comma 4. All the elements present in R4 are present in A cross B? Yes. So, R4 is a relation from A to B. Similarly, R5, R5 has only one element that is ordered pair 2 comma 3. Is R5 is subset of A cross B? Yes. So, R5 is a relation from A to B. Similarly, R6 equals to set which contains only one element that is ordered pair 2 comma 4. Is R6 is a subset of A cross B? Yes, R6 is a subset of A cross B. So, R6 is a relation from A to B. You observe the relations R3, R4, R5, R6. All these relations contains only one element. I hope you are understanding. Till now, we written 6 relations from A to B. Actually, 
we need to get 16 relations from A to B. I quickly revise what are the 6 relations. R1 I taken as an empty set. Empty set is subset of A cross B. So R1 is a relation from A to B. R2 I taken all the elements of A cross B. Uh, we know that uh, every set is subset to itself. So R2 is a relation from A to B. R3, R4, R5, R6 I taken single elements from A cross B. Clearly they are, they are the subsets of A cross B. So they are relations from A to B. Now I will write all the subsets of A cross B which contains two elements. R7, seventh relation. R7 equal to you observe A cross B. You observe A cross B. You take the first element ordered pair 1 comma 3. Write it in R7. R7 is equals to ordered pair 1 comma 3. You move towards right side. Observe A cross B. Move towards right side. What element is there after ordered pair 1 comma 3? Ordered pair 1 comma 4. You write it. So R7 is ordered pair 1 comma 3 comma ordered pair 1 comma 4. R8, 8th relation. You observe A cross B. I am taking again the first element ordered pair 1 comma 3. R8 equals to taking the first element ordered pair 1 comma 3. Now you move towards right side. Observe A cross B. You move towards right side. After order pair 1 comma 3, ordered pair 1 comma 4 is there. That is we already taken in R7. Now what is next immediately? Ordered pair 2 comma 3. So R8 equals to ordered pair 1 comma 3 comma ordered pair 2 comma 3. R9. You observe the A cross B. Take the first element ordered pair 1 comma 3 and move towards right side. After you observe A cross B, after the ordered pair 1 comma 3, next element is ordered pair 1 comma 4 that already written in R7. Immediate next element is ordered pair 2 comma 3 that is already written in R8 and next ordered pair is ordered pair 2 comma 4. So what is R9? R9 is ordered pair 1 comma 3 comma ordered pair 2 comma 4. R10, 10th relation, you observe A cross B. I am taking the second element from A cross B. Second element. Observe the second element. Ordered pair 1 comma 4. So R10 is equals to ordered pair 1 comma 4 comma. Now you observe A cross B. You observe A cross B. Second element. Ordered pair 1 comma 4. What element is there after the element ordered pair 1 comma 4? Immediate right side. What element is there? Ordered pair 2 comma 3. So you write ordered pair 2 comma 3. So what is R10? R10 is set which contains ordered pair 1 comma 4, ordered pair 2 comma 3. Now R11, 11th relation. You observe A cross B. Again I am taking the second element. What is that second element? Ordered pair 1 comma 4. Now you move towards right side. Immediate element is ordered pair 2 comma 3 that we already written in R10. So what is the next immediate element? Ordered pair 2 comma 4. So what is R11 is a set which contains ordered pair 1 comma 4 and ordered pair 2 comma 4. Twelfth relation. Now you observe A cross B. Twelfth relation. You observe A cross B. Take the element ordered pair 2 comma 3 and you move towards right side. What element is there? Ordered pair 2 comma 4. So R12 is ordered pair 2 comma 3 comma ordered pair 2 comma 4. Little trick is there. It can be understood easily with a little bit of practice. I hope you understanding what is going on. Now I'll write all the subsets of A cross B which contains three elements. All the subsets of A cross B which contains three elements. 13th relation. You observe A cross B. I'll take first two elements. Observe A cross B. I'll take first two elements. So R13 equals to ordered pair 1 comma 3 comma ordered pair 1 comma 4. Observe A cross B. After first two elements, what is the immediate element? Ordered pair 2 comma 3. You write it here. So R13 is equals to ordered pair 1 comma 3 comma ordered pair 1 comma 4 comma ordered pair 2 comma 3. Now 14th relation, you observe A cross B, again I will take first two elements, R14, ordered pair 1 comma 3 comma, ordered pair 1 comma 4. Now you move towards right side. After first two elements, if you move towards right side, next immediate element is ordered pair 2 comma 3. 
that we already written in 13th relation. So what is next immediate? Ordered pair 2 comma 4. So 14th relation is ordered pair 1 comma 3 comma ordered pair 1 comma 4 comma ordered pair 2 comma 4. 15th relation. You observe A cross B. Observe A cross B. Now I will take a second element, third element. That is R15 equals to ordered pair 1 comma 4 comma ordered pair 2 comma 3. Now you move towards right side. What is immediate next element is there? That is ordered pair 2 comma 4. That is therefore R15 equals to ordered pair 1 comma 4 comma ordered pair 2 comma 3 comma ordered pair 2 comma 4. Now last relation, 16th relation. You observe R13, R14, R15. In these three relations, R13, R14, R15, we didn't form a relation with first element, third element, fourth element. So, 16th relation R16 equals to which is formed with first element, third element, fourth element. So, R16 equals to ordered pair 1 comma 3 comma ordered pair 2 comma 3 comma ordered pair 2 comma 4. I hope you understand this class. If you like this video, please press like button below. Share this video with your friends. If you are not yet subscribed to my channel, please subscribe now. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.